I'm Jason Robin Hood, and this is my Robin Hood portfolio. Okay, so it is currently 10.05 p.m. Monday, November 30th, 2020, here in San Francisco. And I'm going to do a quick Robin Hood portfolio review for the month of November 2020. As you can see today, we were down during the trading hours, 27 dollars and 47 cents 0.29 percent but in the after hours market we were up 126 dollars and 61 cents 1.33 percent for a total gain today of 99 dollars and 14 cents for the past seven days for the past week we were up 400 dollars 40 51 451 dollars and 63 cents 4.90 percent for the month of November 2020, we were up $1,414.82, 17.15%, an extremely strong month for my portfolio. For the last three months, we're up $418.55, 4.53%. For the past year, since November 30th, 2019, we were we're up $3,350. Fifty dollars ninety-five cents, fifty-three point zero nine percent for the past year, and total since I joined the stock market, which I joined the stock market back in May. I think it was actually April twenty-seventh, but we could say May first, twenty seventeen. We're up a total of three thousand dollars. $3,505.87, 56.92% for a total gain since I joined the stock market with no previous experience, of course. At the moment, we currently have 17 total stocks and a total shares of 54 shares, I believe. Let's see how these stocks performed. A lot of these stocks are recent purchases to my portfolio. We have two shares of Liberty All Star Growth Fund. We're up 20 cents, 1.25%. We have two shares of ticker symbol TRIL. We're down 34 cents, 0.84%. We have two shares of Fastenal. Fastenal is included in the NASDAQ 100. We're down 78 cents, 0.79% for Fastenal. We have three shares of NEO. We're actually down $8.51, 5.39% for NEO. I will be adding to my position in NEO before the end of this year. We have three shares of DraftKings. DraftKings is plus five dollars and ninety-three cents, three point ninety-four percent at the moment. We have two shares of Pin National Gaming. Pin National Gaming is actually down two dollars and ten cents, one point forty-seven percent. We have three shares of Brooks. Automation. Brooks Automation is up eight dollars and eleven cents, three point eighty five percent. We have seventeen point six one five eighty six shares of Apple. I use the dividend in Apple to reinvest it with a drip, so that's why that explains the point. Zero sixty one five eighty six percent shares in Apple. Apple represents twenty one point thirty five thirty four percent of my portfolio, and total return is plus five hundred and one dollars forty three cents, plus thirty two point fifteen percent. I will most likely continue to add to my position in Apple, hopefully before the end of this year. 
I would like to own maybe about 20 shares before the end of this year, if not like 25 shares, of course. We have two shares of Nike. Nike is included in a Dow Jones 100. Total return is plus $20.66 plus 8.31% return from Nike. I just added two shares of Moderna today, basically. And Moderna is up, wow, $15 total and plus 4.81% of Moderna. I would like to add to my position in the stock with the vaccine news coming out. So I, I think Moderna is still extremely cheap. We have two shares of TQQQ. The TQQQ is a three-time levered ETF that follows the NASDAQ 100. Total return plus $70.85 plus 28.15%. We have two shares of ticker symbol FVRR. Total return plus $168.02 plus 71.20%. Extremely strong performance from this stock this year. We have two shares of Square. Square total return is plus $117.06. Plus 38.36% from Square. Extremely strong performance from Square. I believe this is a local San Francisco company. I just want to make sure. Square is a local San Francisco company. San Francisco, please stand up. We have two shares of DocuSign. DocuSign is definitely a San Francisco company. Please stand up, San Francisco. Let me see where we're at. Only plus $24.07, 5.68% from DocuSign. We have two shares of Cooper Software. Cooper Software total return is plus $165.69 plus 33.66%. Cooper Software is a local Bay Area company headquartered in San Mateo. Shout out to San Mateo. We have 4.0014 shares of NVIDIA. The zero the 0014 is a reinvested dividend I use for the drip with NVIDIA. NVIDIA represents 22.27% of my portfolio with a total return of $416.52 plus 24.01% return from NVIDIA. And last but not least, we have three shares of Tesla. Tesla represents 18.39% of my portfolio with a total return of plus $536.58 plus 43.26% for Tesla. There you have it. That's 17 stocks total with a total shares of 54 shares. How was your November 2020 in the stock market? How did your portfolio perform this month? Did you find any new stocks in this video? Do you have any great performance stocks in your portfolio you would like to recommend to myself or the other viewers of this video? I'm Jason Robinhood. This is my Robinhood portfolio. Stay long in the stock market.